Hey guys and welcome back to another Tower Defense Simulator video. Today it is Christmas, but also Halloween because Tower Defense Simulator still has the Halloween update. I did hear though that in about a week they will do a winter event, so I'm super duper excited for that. Now what I originally wanted to do was do hardcore mode, but unfortunately because of all the Christmas and all the holiday stuff, I didn't have a lot of time to grind to level 50. That said, I asked you guys what would you want to see in Tower Defense Simulator and actually a lot of you guys just said I want to see you beat maps that you haven't beaten before. So that is what we're going to do today. Of course, I don't want to do that alone. I really like to play with random people, believe it or not. So let's move over to a public server and join some people in maps that we haven't played before. Let's go. Okay, which maps haven't we not done before? I don't think I've done four seasons yet, have I? I don't remember me beating Four Seasons. I think I played on it once for a video, but I never actually beaten it. So uh, yeah, let's do Four Seasons and, uh, you know, see if we can beat it. It's gonna be fun. I wonder which mode my friend... Oh, he wants to do normal. Uh, can we do molten, please? I think molten is a little bit easier, mister, please. Please? Oh no, I guess we're actually gonna do normal. Um, okay. Because we're gonna do normal, I need to change my strategy up a bit. He plays down a soldier, which means I am probably safe to put down two farms. And uh, after that, I will place down my military base to help assist this little fella in damage. He actually changed to Molten last minute. He actually changed to Molten last minute. Let's go, dude. Okay, I need to get my military base as soon as possible because I, I just want to assist him a lot. I, I think that would be nice of me. So let's place them over... Let's place them here at the beach. I think that looks really cool. So there we go. So now we get a car every once in a while to kill all his, you know, zombies that he can't clean up. And in the meantime, we're gonna just, just gonna farm some arcades. It's gonna be fun. We're gonna keep skipping because skipping is, you know, amazing and fun. And uh, here's my car coming. Hello, little car. <laughs> Christmas dab, Christmas dab, Christmas dab, Christmas dab. Okay, let me place down another farm. And also upgrade it in a couple of seconds. Wait for it. And one cash more. Poof, there we go. I love this farm. I still love this farm. You guys have been letting me know. That there is actually a lot cooler farms than these. And a really cool military base skin. So I might want to buy premium crates in the future. The only thing holding me back right now is that the, you know, the winter event is almost coming. So I'm probably going to save until the winter event. And see if the winter event has some cool skins. That's another farm. And another farm. And another farm. And even another farm. And we're gonna upgrade you. There we go. Look at my little arcade. I actually placed them really well. Except for this little part. That kind of sucks. Aww. This guy is actually doing work with his soldiers. He does have a sniper though. Which that's a little bit of a shame. But he is actually putting in work. Like he is probably obviously kind of new. Because he still has soldiers and snipers. But he doesn't place them actually too bad. Like, he does know how placing stuff works, which that's actually kind of cool and useful. Thank you, my guy. In that case, I can focus on just farming forever. Farming forever, farming forever, I'm gonna farm forever. I placed down a secondary military base just for the fact that we're uh, getting the bosses right now. I, I don't think this round, but the bosses are actually coming and I just want to support them a little bit more. Uh, because I don't think it's fun if I, you know, farm the entire time. Uh, so yeah, I, I put down a second military base just to let the rounds go a little bit more smoothly. And uh, now back to some farming more. And uh, when I get enough money, I probably want to place down a DJ booth for him. 
Just so he has a little bit easier time upgrading his units. I think it would be nice of me. I really like this upgrade of the arcade. This is my favorite upgrade. Because I, I don't know. I just really like this one. Uh, the next upgrade is also kind of cute. I'm not a big fan of like the golden end game uh, farm. But I, this is one of my favorites. Like level 3. Really love it. Really love it. Here you go buddy. Yeah. There you go. Your upgrade should be a little bit more, you know, cheap. So I hope that helps you. There we go. Also, you get a little bit more range for your soldiers, which is nice. And this guy will die easily. Okay, cool. There you go. I just upgraded my two military bases so that the new cars actually spawn with guns. Because we're getting quite a lot of big normal bosses and my little friend over here isn't handling it very well. So I hope with like having the shooters on the roof, I can support him a lot more. Because I feel like, you know, he's not handling it too well. But there we go. They do a lot of damage. So it's all gonna be okay. A-okay. -okay. Boom. There we go. There we go. I also set up my commanders for the commando chain, just so he doesn't place anything here. Uh, because I really like them to have them all in a straight line. Uh, let's upgrade one of the farms to max, there we go. And uh, yeah, so far I think it should be enough. I might want to upgrade one commander uh, to the level of the call of arms, just to be safe. Better safe than sorry. Uh, and after we get that... We can uh, go, you know, all out with uh, farms and damage. And there we go. That's some nice damage. Yeah. We're doing a lot of call of arms chains because I feel a little bit scared that we might not win this. Uh, because we don't have the best of damage right now. Uh, so I want to place down my turrets as soon as possible. Even though the farm isn't maxed yet. I feel like we really need the damage right now because it's getting really scary. Actually, I'm actually getting really scared and I just I just want to help this guy win. So yeah, let's put down a turret as soon as possible. Like this guy is taking no damage. Oh, I can place a turret. Let's place it over here. There we go. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. There we go. There we go. Let's do a call of arms. Okay, maybe you then. There we go. And yes, that's going a lot faster. Okay, okay, okay. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. I'm actually getting really close to maxing out the farms. Let's go. Yes, yes, yes. Things are actually shaping up again. It looked down a little bit, but now th things are amazing. Things are fine. And this is the last. Boom, there we go. Farms are max. Now we can focus on getting the DJ max and then we can go all out. Yeah. And boom, DJ max. Let's go, let's go, let's go. So now I want to place all my turrets just on level 1. Just so we have the placement out of the way. So boom. And I think I can place one more. Which I want to place over here. And that is the max turret amount. And now we can just all slowly but surely upgrade them. Keep spamming call of arms. And everything will be alright. Look at all these bosses. Look at all these bosses. And they're all gonna die very, very easily. Thanks to all the turrets, all the soldiers, the DJ, all the call of armor spam. There we go. Yeah, let's go. I love this. This is my favorite part of Tower Defense Simulator. Is just watching all the bosses die. I love it. And that is all the turrets max. Let's go. Now we can focus on selling these military bases because I want them close to the DJ. So let's place one there. Place one here. Place one here. One here. Oh, we can't. Okay, we can place it there. This one here. This one. Oh, that's already the max. Yeah, now we can just upgrade these and we have a wonderful time. Call of arms. And boom, the first tank is max. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Call of arms. Bye, guys. Oh, look at that HP. Bye-bye. Here we are at the final boss wave. So normally, you would sell your farms, but I don't have any units that need upgrading anymore. 
So I will just leave my farmers be. That's the reason why. Uh, and we're just gonna keep spamming call of arms until it dies. That's basically it. Very, very exciting. His HP is actually going down pretty fast. I like that. Bye bye. Woohoo! Woohoo! Hey, don't hit that little guy. No. Oh, that's mean. That's mean. Oh, the backwalker. Whoa, moonwalk. There he goes. Oh, and he's down. Uh oh. You know what, Molten Boss? I feel kind of bad for you. But not really. Yay, we triumphed. But anyway, guys, that was all the time I had for today. It's still Christmas, so we still got a lot to do. But anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. If you like this video and want to see more, please hit that like and subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!